his net's falling apart. This is uh, this is a comedy. <laughs> Do you need help, mate? Or can you manage it? You can, you can manage it. I tell you what, I'll run and get my net. You keep it playing. Welcome to Fishing Discoveries. You join me on a balmy July evening on the banks of the tidal River Trent. Just managed to get out with Gary again. He's in a peg just upstream of me. Um, we've come for an evening session. Arrived here just after midday. Um, we picked a line where we want to fish and put quite a few feeders full of bait. So there's quite a flow on today. We've had a bit of sort of thunderstorms this past week so there's a little bit of extra water in the river um, it's pushing through quite strong and we're on the outside of a bend just upstream about maybe 70 or 80 yards so the current's pushing over onto this bank we don't have to fish out far to be in the main flow um, I'm not as cautious about my sort of rig as I was in the broad daylight session that we had so it's just a case now, waiting for that four foot twitch and we'll see you if we get a fish. It wasn't long before rain really put a dint in our plans. All hope of using the fancy camera gear was out of the window, but I had brought with me a GoPro and a couple of spare batteries. So we were able to do just a little bit of filming in absolute lashing rain. Apologies in advance, the rain was actually running into the mic on the GoPro, so some of this might be a little bit sketchy sound-wise. Gary's into a fish. I'm going to sit under his brolly and film him. <laughs> because it's absolutely lashing down. <laughs> After you struck? No. Before, before, before you... Well, I can see you sat no more than a couple of feet from your rods. Yeah. So, uh, the rod right? there's a good chance you can't hear Gary because um, he's facing away in a hood. <laughs> um, but he said it took quite a few yards of line on the take. So, a little bit more than a four foot twitch. Looks a good fight. This has took a lot of line. Look, looks like it, it went halfway across river. Ah, I can see a bit of a boil now. Here it comes. This might not be a... Loosen that drag off mate, don't let him bust you. Yeah, I just flattened it off. I just softened the drag a bit. Yeah. So this is uh, almost exactly on low tide, maybe 15 minutes after, his net's falling apart, this is, uh, this is a comedy. <laughs> Do you need help, mate? Or can you manage it? Manage it. You, can, you can manage it. Oh, 
I'll tell you what, I'll run and get my net. You keep it playing. Lucky I'm only on the next peg. But Gary's landing that and will just snap like a twig. I don't know if he's banged it. Here you come, mate. Just watch out over your head. Okay. I don't know what our lens is. I don't know if you can see this. But it's absolutely lashing it down. I'm getting a soak in here. Is the landing net totally snapped? Hey? Did landing net snap? I, or did I, it just I come apart? I got it off in and it, and it, it worked weight on it and it just cracked it open. So I didn't, my fault really. Although, I'll see if I can get it on. I've not seen it yet. No, I haven't. I've got water running down my sleeve. I can't even see it viewfinder. There's that much rain on back at camera. I do hope that uh, I'm showing folks at home. Watch that, watch that. That's half your problem. You're trying to lift full weight at Nat out instead of sliding it. Oh, it looks a belter, mate. That might. Um, I don't want to speak too soon. I reckon it's got to be at least nine pound. Wow, that's fighting hard. Yeah, maybe seven pound. Okay, well done mate. Get him level in that. That's it, he's going up right. Tell us what you think. That was the hardest fight I've ever had. That went, incredible. Uh, that went round and round. Just hold, hold him out a bit further into the main flat. That's it. That's it. Getting him up right. Let him recover in that. You're going to want to leave him there. Five minutes yeah. or so mate so uh, I've got a rod out I've just cracked off uh, on a snag have you yeah so I'm gonna go back get under my brolly and get that fixed and I'll come back and do release for you all right yeah he in needs a bit. To recover you're all right a bit, you're yeah. in a good rest all right turn the camera off then we'll be back in a few minutes okay scales are on and they're zero so you can weigh everything it's weighed in after yeah like you got to thing in the uh, feeder Watch this. Okay. <laughs> okay, so it's here. So it's telling us uh, when it freezes. It's about 11, 11 13, 11, 11 13. 11.13? Yeah, that's one I've seen most of. 11.13, so you need to walk some track stuff after. So let's have a look at the fish, mate, and then you can put him back. Just hold him up for the camera and then I'll let you. You're going to have to get down into the walk with him, aren't you? Yeah, well, we do. certainly no worries that fish are stick, keeping nice and wet in this. up on screen what he actually weighed when we get away to that where I'm not gonna hang around and weigh that. Hold him nice and low, let's have a good look. It'll not be double figures but it'll, it'll be sort of eight, eight pound odd. That's fantastic that is mate. That's absolutely fantastic, well done. I'll let you uh, I'll let you sort out putting him back, getting back in sling and um I'll hook from the neck at the minute. Okie doke we can chuck that out of way then can't you? careful you don't slide out yeah. you've got to keep it nice and flat there we go
Gary's checking one for the team here and going in with it. <laughs> nice one, mate. You look for a fish. Yeah, belter. I'll be interested. Oh, cool. Yeah, what you don't, uh, what you don't for it. He's had, how long has he had it? He must have had, More than five minutes. I was going to say it must have been going on for ten minutes because I've had to re rig while you've been resting him. He's not ready yet. No. The seat's off for him. I don't know if anyone will be able to see any of this. It's. Uh, camera soaking wet, I can't see the viewfinder for raindrops on it. I, I <laughs> can going, just tell, uh, br brilliant, well done mate. That's, pr that's probably going to be a PB. Do you want me to stick around while you weigh all that? Yeah, gonna. Yeah, you would do, wouldn't you? Keep me soaking wet as well. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you've got, you want to weigh net and uh, weigh sling, so uh, it, stuff couldn't get any more wet, could it? No. Nope. Got your scales there, didn't it? Probably need to turn them back on, won't you? Yeah. Turn them on and hold them vertical so you get your zero with nothing on them. Yeah. Jesus, it's it's raining like. What was it? 11.13? 11 11.13, 11 13, yeah. So what we got? Not, oh, no. not zero. <laughs> zero now. Zero now, yeah. On. Let's see what it is. Three nine. Three pound nine. So that's uh, eight pounds four. I don't know. Eleven um, thirteen. Eleven thirteen. So ten nine eight and um, nine off thirteen. So four. yeah, eight pound four. four. Yeah. I'll do me. Well done, mate. Do that's, from, that, that's slightly bigger than your big one. You, you had one remember. dead on eight. Dead on eight before. Was it eight? Right, here's a PB then. So it's a PB for Gary. Well done, mate. See I need to uh, go and get go back on, on my rods now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> get baited Look up. at this rain. Right? It's biblical. <laughs> <laughs>